Hello everybody and welcome back to Willow Wire. Today we are playing Merwin for the first time in two years. And I've got just a basic understanding of how the controls work now. It's been a while. I know this is the game that jumping and running bring up your uh, skills. Um, I don't remember everything that we did, so let's take a quick little recap here. Uh, something about that. Uh, okay, so I gotta go to Fort Moonmouth. Or Moonmouth. I don't remember. And I need flowers. Well, what's my menu? There we go. Okay, so I'm a rogue. Okay. It's not really coming back to me, to be honest. Um. A tax record. I need a house. That's what I need. I got lots of soul gems. Nothing to, nothing to repair. A really crappy sword. Looks like some throwing swords or knives. I mean, um, yeah. So, oh, and I might have. Okay, gold canet, stone flower, I got the anther, and heather. Okay. We got the heather. There's the anther. Alright, we need a couple flowers. And I think it's this way. Keyword, I think. Good thing I can breathe underwater, because I don't remember how to do that. Am I crouch? No. Everything's just giant. Why is everything so big? Seriously, the plants in this place are huge. I really don't know how to run. That's how you jump. That's how you duck. That's third person. Is it... No. No. I don't think you can run in this game. Which is weird because I totally thought you could. Huh. I don't know. I honestly haven't got a single clue. That was easy. Oh great, here we go again. I forgot this game is like entirely based upon your stats. And I say that differently from Skyrim because in Skyrim it wouldn't matter if your stamina was completely gone. In this one it does. If your stamina is gone in this one, then it's harder to hit things. My god, you move so slow in this. Like, I really feel like there should have been a run. Okay, what am I looking for exactly here? I'm looking for a gold canet and a stone flower petal. I'm not really having much luck. What about you? Chokeweed? How about you? Crushweed. Oh boy. Oh, here's some stone flowers. Alright. Lastly, I need the gold canet. Ow. Not you. I shall not lose to you. You shall feel my wrath. 
Oh, I didn't even get anything for that. I don't think those were gold connect anyway. Just who are you? Colonel Omaran. See a skooma pipe. See ya. Here's your stuff. Sorry I couldn't stay and chat with you, but it's not always a good idea for me to hang around, you know? Um... So... Where's Sia supposed to be? Hmm... Well, that's not a gold connect item. If I were a gold cadet, where would I be? Not over there by that Nyx. That's all. Oh God, it found me. Run away! I need more stamina. I don't know what that spell is. Down we go. I don't think they can go in the water. Breath. I thought I was an Argonian. Am I not? I am an Argonian. What's up with that? This whole island is basically just death. Why would anybody want to live here? That was unexpected. Okay, we're going to try the other side of town. I'm not seeing much. I'm not even seeing any plants. The rat. Lots and lots of rocks. And giant mushrooms. Oh, dear. I wonder if those giant mushrooms are edible. Gold connect, maybe? Willow flowers of emptiness. Gold can. Oh. Damn gold canets. Why are there no plants? Oh, what is this? Should I be here? To go or not to go? Fairies. Just because I don't remember if this actually saves. Yeah, see this beefy lizard one here? This is that I played a beefy lizard one about a year ago. And the funny thing is, I don't remember playing it since this one. So, yeah, I don't understand that. Well, how do I untrap it? Well, that didn't work. Am I just permalized? Oh. Oh no. Uh. I don't know. It doesn't say what it's made out of. Uh oh. Bad juju.
this is uh working out amazingly. Okay, I've had enough. That did not work at all. Let's go ahead and check out that gold canet again. Why are these all empty? The one flower I need is not here. I see humans. Maybe they can help me. Humans, I need your help. He's a miner. All right. You've got I'm my listening. ear. Let's hear it. Oh, yeah, I'm not doing that if I didn't already. I think I did last time, didn't I? Can't remember. Hmm. The one and only patch. And I can't even use it. Oh, in case you're wondering why some of my abilities in this game are gone. It's because uh, there's differences in controls because I'm playing this on the Xbox One instead of the Xbox original. So, for instance, the white and black buttons are gone. I missed those. I wish they'd come back. And I could have sworn there was a way to run. Oh, die plateau. Well, I'm still not seeing any uh, gold canets. Plenty of death and despair. That was my radiator. I really wish they would remake this game. Give it all new graphics. Go and add to the gameplay. That would be awesome. Do I have a map? I've been here before. Well, let's just go up this way and see if we can find one. Have I been in there? Ow. Oh, it's you. Well, that got me far. With a name like that, you know you shouldn't enter. But you do it anyway. Oh dear god. Oh dear god, we run away. Run. You coming? No? Good, stay in there. Uh, I think I've been in there before too. <laughs> I need a bed. Weird, I thought I just saw something. Oh, there's a village, maybe I can find an inn. Oh, it's this place. Never mind. Here's a scribble. Not getting very far in this episode, am I? Yay! Progress. It's really weird because I know you guys can't see it, but there's a mic that's like right in my line of sight. And it's kind of annoying. Yay! That's actually a good thing. Why am I not getting any items? Like, at all.
Wow. Do I have any healing at all? This is horrible. What is that, Skuma? No. Well, I don't want to go that way when I'm this injured. And there's another one over there. So, I'm like, pretty much dead. I guess I got no choice but to stop by that town. I can't rest. I like how every time I jump, my character like glitches out. I don't know if maybe my game is just too quiet or what, but there's like no sound at all. Hey you, can you bring me somewhere? I got a lot of money. Let's check the map real quick. Cause I've been to Belmora. There's Caldera. Narmok is all the way the hell up there. Have I been to Vivek yet? Yep, I've been to Vivek. Let's go to Narmok. I don't recall nope. using teleportation, and yet there I was, alone, naked. Hmm. Not getting very far here yet. Some of my health came back though. How far am I from leveling up? Seven more skills. <sighs> I probably need a stir. Hey, look. Something imperialistic. Wow, is that all this place is? This itty bitty little area? Whatever. I keep feeling like I can run, but I can't really annoying okay let's check the map again all right caldera's way over there caldera is definitely a place that would be nice to visit nope don't hang him off in this game to think all this for one plant Oh. Lunibi to fudge. How dare you? Okay, as I was saying, Lunibi carcass of the saint. It's concerning. Is there a way to I wish there was a way to permanently, like, if you press in, have your sneak remain sneak. One of the something else I can... See, black and white is rest. But you know what? Uh, which one is this? That's so much easier. If I go down there, I might be screwed. So I'm going to save.
All right, let's explore. Doesn't appear to be anything in the water. Oh, this does not look promising. This looks very bad. There's a human there. I don't know if they're going to be good or bad. This isn't good. There's a dead guy over there. It's not good. Second I saw it was a dreamer, I knew it was bad. Yep. Okay, so I can actually explain this a bit. A dreamer is somebody who has been corrupted by, I believe in this game, it's Dagoth Ur. And that corpus meat they're carrying, you'll see those enemies soon. And if you get attacked by a corpus and you catch corpus, I haven't gotten the full result. But essentially, if you have corpus, you turn into a hulking mass of insanity. And there's no cure. What am I wearing? I am wearing light armor of 12. And a 6 shield. I got 12 shield. So yeah, no, that's any use to me. But, I mean, technically it's good to wipe out these places because, you know, dreamers are bad. On a side note, however, if you get caught by any corpus thingies in here, you could end up contracting corpus. I don't have any marksman things except for those daggers. Can you see me? Are you a vampire? What are you? You're walking a little strange. I'm a little concerned. You look an awful lot like a dreamer, but you also... Oh, you're an ash slave. Oh, I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm so dead. Oh, I'm dead. Oh, I'm dead. Oh, no. Oh, no. What can I eat to restore health? Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh no 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 no. I think I'm dead. Hail. Oh. I was already dead. See? Now this is why I saved. While my game trips out. So essentially all I did was go and kill off that same dude I killed last time just to grab the same stuff. I didn't go back over again. Figured there was no point in really going and doing that. Am I even going the right way anymore? Oh, I got hiccups. Yeah, here we go. So apparently Narmok is this entire place. Mud crab. There we go. Wait a minute. Oh, I went the wrong way the first time. Oh well, whatever, I got this other place all taken care of. What the heck? Bad fishies. You dead? Nope. Ha. Okay. 
Let's go this way. Ouch! No! Why is the net attacking me? Why is the net attacking me? Which way? This way. Go, go, go. Ouch! Why? What did I do to you? Ouch! Oh no! They don't typically attack. Yeah, that's right. You stay stuck on that tree. Well, I run away. I can't take on a bull netch. Flee. Man, now I'm injured again. Oh, definitely not taking on those. At this point, I only want to take on the rat. I'm getting all sorts of beat up. Now the Kwama's coming after me. As far away as I am, he's still coming after me. This is one of those times I really wish I had the boots of blinding speed. So I wonder how to use this. Like, I don't even know what that spell is. Oh, it's Hearth Heal. Hmm. Didn't do me a lot of good. There's another rat. My word. Why is this so far away? Did I make it over the hill? You know another sad thing about this game that I wish they had? Horses. There are no horses in this game. Oh, that didn't work. My jump's not good enough. But once you start really going through this game and you start, you know, getting everything, it gets a lot better. Like, you can make spells that let you basically permanently fly. Oh, great. Oh, I hope he doesn't attack me, because I'm going to die if he does. <laughs> Oh, fudge and nix. There's so much death. Okay, I'm going to try something. I don't know if it's going to work. Oh, right. I'll just try five hours. Oh, I forgot to hit the heal button. I forgot this game is... Oh, well, that still works. Yeah, that still works. I think that's that one dude. And if he is, I need to avoid him. <gasps> Wait, those boots. Are they? Could they be? Your wounds don't look too bad, but you just find healing regardless. Making a deal? Look, I'm just a poor merchant just trying to make my way to Narmok with some trade goods. I could use an escort. Though since mine seems to have buggered off, if you'd be willing to take me there, I'd give you... No, I shouldn't. Although it is dangerous. A dangerous trip. Alright. I'll give you the boots of blinding speed. Although, although I'll be overpaying you by quite a bit. Yeah, I'll take it in our mock. Hells yeah. But first, I really need to get to town. So that I myself can heal and get some items. It's kind of funny. I was literally just talking about the boots, but boots, the boots of blinding speed, and then here she is. Actually, I didn't even know it was on a girl. I thought it was like a quest item that you would like find somewhere. That's really weird. I wonder if she's a random show up or if she's just naturally here. It's been so long since I've actually done this. Like, when, when I say long that I've done this, I don't mean long since I picked up the game. I mean, all these events that I'm doing right now, I have not done in about 20 years, give or take. I'm pretty close, I'm pretty sure I was close to between 10 to 14 years old. And I'm 31 now, so... 
It was a long time ago. What the heck? He's naked. Sir, do you realize that you're naked? I can't help you. Got healed elsewhere. Hail and well met, stranger. As you can plainly see, I require some assistance. If you'd be kind enough to grant it, I need help finding the festering witch who has robbed me blind and left me for dead. A witch she had to be. I was on my way to Caldera when I met her. She was a stranger here like myself, and our conversations lightened the burden of travel. She was quite friendly, and well, you know, we set up uh, oh, uh, camp together. Uh, but that night, she revealed the witch inside, cast a spell on me. I couldn't so much as blink. Stole everything, even my worn-out clothes. But most importantly, she took my prized axe, Cloud Cleaver. Join with me, stranger. Let's find her and extract her entrails together. I knew you had the, the bloodlust in you, stranger. I believe she is still camped where I left her up to the northwest. Though I could be wrong, as the spell disoriented me a bit. It did. You know this area better than me. Lead the way. This witch shall rue the day she met Hlarmar Winesot. Okay. Um. Well, I suppose we can do that. I hope I don't lose my person. How would I know where your spot is exactly? Do you think I just know where people can't? There's no quest marker. There's no... You're not very good at giving directions, sir. It says it's Caldera, but I'm not seeing the town anywhere. I've been playing this now for an obscenely long amount of time, and I've barely made any progress at all. This is definitely a very time-consuming game. There's Caldera. Caldera, if I remember correctly, is one of my favorite places to go. If I remember right, you can get a house, and this place is quite big. Quite large, big, whatever. There's the Mage's Guild. Lots of guards. Oh, pawnbroker. <sighs> All right, let's see here. I need some silver. Doesn't say if it's silver or not. Well, it was a silver dagger, I guess. Well, that's kind of cool. Okay, now where's my sail? How do I sail? I definitely don't need all this iron crap. Hmm. Well, I guess that's pretty much all I've got. I don't really need that. 
Okay, and now done. And it would be more. Whatever. Okay. Persuasion. Let's give him another. Are you serious? There, take that. A hole. What's your story? I don't know if I can open a book without stealing it. So I don't really want to risk it. There's the castle. I don't really remember how this works. Well, yeah, let's go to the trader. Maybe the trader has something I can use. There we go. That's a spear, though. I'm pretty sure I need a sword, short sword. Yep. This would work nicely. And then there's also a bow here. So let's get this. And we'll also get the that'd be kind of cool. Well, like kind of cool. I don't know what recall does. I would get the bow, but the problem is I don't remember how rare these arrows are in this game. There's so much stuff to choose from. Do you have gold snap? You do. I don't know how many she wanted, but hey, you know what? That works. That's an expensive potion that I do not feel like trying to get. You suck. Can I take it for one dollar less? No, you can't take it for one dollar less. I'm afraid to try sneak things in this because I haven't done it yet. And there's a lot of guards here. Yes. Alright, well, I'm going to consider that good. But I want to go to an inn first. Well, I mean, it might be an inn. Yep. Not what I wanted. I want a bed. Ten dollars? Hell yeah, I want that bed. Where's the bed? Is this the bed? No. Who are you? You can train me. Oh, you're expansive. Okay, no. Get out of the way. Rest and heal your wounds. Get out of my... Thank you. Uh, this room? No. This room? Yes. There, my first time using an inn. Alright, now let's get out of here before these two trap me in here forever. I think you get a rested bonus in this game, but I can't really remember. Be well, traveler. I don't know why, but every time I see an Argonian, I think they're a, uh, mage. Well, 
Okay, so we're on to... What a breathing actually costs. Okay, well, whatever. We're on to Narmok. We're gonna go this way. We're gonna go this way and hold hope for the best. Where are you guys going? Gonna say we're gonna go this way. You will die well. What is with all the Nick sound? Mind who you're fighting. Sorry, I was trying to stab a Nick sound, and you stepped in the way. I haven't seen that witch yet, and he still hasn't given me any instructions on how to get to that witch. Which way to the witch, my friend? Well, it appears I have lost her. That figures. Oh, there she is. She's got the boots of blinding light on, or speed on, and uh, she still can't keep up. My word, why is she so slow? She takes like the long way around everything. Still not seeing any witches. They're just gonna be following me for like freaking ever from the looks of things. I hope that this thing doesn't go and attack me. I really, really don't want it to attack me. Cause I don't got no bows and I don't got no long swords. And actually, I think of it. It might help if I equip my sword. I lied. We're just going to use that for ghosts. Well, there's one. Where are you guys going? What is wrong with you guys? Down here. I don't really care about the other guy. He'll catch up someday. Hey, maybe I'll even find that witch for him without him even showing up. Hey, wait, is fast travel a thing? It does not look like it. Oh well, I guess he's lost forever. And then one of the future episodes, like 30 episodes down the row, he shows up again. Gotta really use this help with that freaking bull match. Cause I have a feeling she ain't gonna run. So just have to keep an eye out for it. All the others still seem to be here. You know, she states it's really dangerous, but we haven't even found any battles on the way. Except for in front of Caldera, which we weren't even supposed to go to to begin with. Oh, and there's the bull netch. Still stuck on the tree.
Alright, hurry along before the thing gets us. Where'd she go? Are you seriously truck stuck on a tree? Lady, come on. That thing ain't playing around. Worst part is I know when I start to cross this water, I'm gonna start getting some freaking fish. Yep, there it is. a lot of fish. There's one down. There we go. Lady, where are you going? You need to go over here. And get your butt over to the land. Before more of those dang things come and show up. Oh, where'd she go? Well, I can see the cliff rays are stuck. Okay, she's coming. She's coming. Slow as hell, but she's coming. All right, we're in Narmok. Well, this is close enough. Thanks for your help. I suppose it's only fair that I give you your reward. Here, take them. Though it pains me to give them, you are now the owner of the Boots of Blinding Speed. Yay! Ha, <laughs> you're barefoot. Okay, so firstly we should save because I'm going to show you guys what this does. Okay, so this is actually really cool. <gasps> oh, that's just mean. Hey, where's my boots? Wait a minute. My boots are gone. Like it's completely removed them from existence. Um, lesson learned for one beast races can't use them and two don't try to use them as a beast because they disappear okay so we're gonna reload I guess this means I'll have to do it the hard way uh, basically, what I'm going to have to do is take the enchantment from the boots and put it into an enchantment for something else, which costs a lot of money, and you have to go to the Mage's Guild to do it. I don't remember which one. Do I still have them now? Yes, good. I still can't believe that just happened. Huh. That's really annoying. I mean, we're here now, so that's at least something. So what I'm going to do next is take the boat to another location. Maybe talk to somebody first. You 
have That's mine. good. Outlander, what do you want? Hmm. Wow, Pemini the traitor has a bounty on her head. So, Pemini the traitor. Which one is Pemini? Wait, wait a minute. Weren't you Pemini? What's you your... are Pemini. A bounty on my head? Preposterous. It must be a case of mistaken identity. I can't imagine why anybody would want to arrest me. I've always been an honest trader. As I've told you, it must have been someone else they're thinking of. This conversation is quickly becoming tiresome. Nah. Okay, I'm reloading because that was not worth it. She sounded insincere at best. Could do it again to get the update again, but... My skill in speechcraft is really low. Well. So basically... If I want my skill to get better, I would need to, uh, go and find somebody to teach me. Outlander, what do you want? Cool, and hello, Ode. Have I been to either of these places? Been to Hilla. I haven't been to Cool yet. We're going to Cool. What is this regarding Argonia? Who are you? Severe. Oh. Yeah, I'd rather not go there. Oh wow, we're way up there now. Well, let's explore around a little bit, shall we? I want a house. I'm gonna have to look up how to get a house. I think that you actually have the ability to kill somebody and take their house afterwards. But there's a lot of issues with doing that. For instance, in this game, if you kill the did I kill this one? I guess I did. If you kill the wrong person in this game, for one, they stay dead forever, and two, it will pop up with the thing saying that you can continue playing the game, but you can never complete it. Hmm. Ah, we'll leave that. What have we here? It's a Strider. Where can you take me? Destination. Travel to... Let's go to Genesis. 
Those things are not the funnest to kill. Hello there. As you can see, we are playing Meadowwind. I was actually getting yes, close to finishing up this episode. I seriously, you're not fucking out. Yeah. Yeah, you don't make very much progress in this very quickly. Water. I don't need your stuff. As it is, I'm trying very hard to find a place to get a home. But it's, it's been so long, I don't remember how. I think you just find somebody, kill them, and take their home. But if you do that wrong, you'll go to jail. And that's saying you can kill them to begin with. You're not in camera, by the way. I know. I ju I'm just a giant floating head. <laughs> I don't even know if anybody can hear you. I don't know. Oh, yeah, I guess you can. Very faint, you probably. That's a cave dwelling? Well, what about this place? <laughs> I like how he just dropped. I can't find a home. You're homeless. I wonder what's with all the cave dwellings. Man, TT. Man titty? Yeah. It was man titty cave dwelling. <laughs> well, this place sucks. On to the next location. Where even is this? The problem is, I'm starting to collect stuff. If you collect stuff, but you got. Oh, I just went back to see the news feed. Why walk when you can ride? Dang it. Actually, you know what? I killed somebody here. And I've still got those tax papers. So where is the guy that I killed house? Yes. And we didn't bring back the tax paperwork yet. I believe it was this dude. Apparently, he does not want it. I huh. must be going before you could make it fit. I find it weird that's a lock level 100. Wahaha. Ha. Why is that a lock level 100? It doesn't even go anywhere. Alright, let's check these houses and see if he's still here. Does that shack not have a door? Hmm. 
Hmm. Oh, I guess I just thought I hadn't. Okay, so all of these shacks have a name on them. So I need to find... I need to find the guy that killed him. And I technically know who it is. Thing is, I don't remember if I killed him. I don't honestly really remember anything about it. Go ahead. You have no manner. I think it's you. Hmm. I don't know. Alright everyone, so I have been playing this for quite some time, and I haven't really made any progress at all. I was really hoping I'd make more than this, but, you know, it is what it is. So I'm going to have to call this good here, I think. And if you guys have enjoyed this, hit that like and subscribe button. I'll do some research, figure out what I need to do to get a house, and then we'll try for that on the next episode. Hope you guys have enjoyed. Bye!